click the bell icon to get latest videos from ekida hello friends now we are studying a new chapter and that is coordination compounds so now let us understand what are coordination compounds and what are the bonds that are been involved in it so this is what we are going to talk about so now let us understand this one so friends now here we are going to talk about the coordinate compounds so for that let us understand the definition of it that is the compounds in which the central metal atom is linked to number of ions or neutral molecules by coordinate bonds are known as coordination compounds so based on that let me give you a certain example so that you could understand what are coordination compounds in very easy manner so now let me explain you with the help of an example so that you could understand what are actually coordination compounds so coordination compounds for example if i'm talking about that is this is platinum that has been surrounded by six that is amine groups and actually coordination compounds are basically written with the help of this bracket over here because this represents that is this is nothing but a complex which is also known as coordination compound so in this case as you can see that is the platinum that is the main metal or the central metal atom it has been surrounded by that is six amine group so in that case let me mention here that is one this is two this is three this is fourth one this is fifth and this is sixth so here the geometry is also is different and this is what we are going to talk about in the future lecture but let us understand that is this all are the groups that are basically surrounding this central metal atom and that's the reason that this compound overall is known as a complex or it is also called as a coordination compound and what is this bond this bond is actually known as coordinate bond so what are actually coordinate bond let us understand with the help of the definition so the coordinate bond is basically the coordinate bond is a type of covalent bond in which both the shared pair of the electrons are contributed by one atom only so in this case let me give you an example so this is the example where we can find that is the ammonia group is basically surrounding this platinum atom or the central metal so in this case as you understand that is the nitrogen consists of lone pair of electron and that's the reason that this lone pair of electron or this shared pair of electron is towards the platinum and that's the reason that all these bonds are basically known as coordinate bonds so therefore this is nothing but a complex which is also known as coordination compound because there is an involvement of the coordination covalent bond in it and this all are basically known as ligands but based on that let me discuss about the ligands and the classification in the future topic but this is what we can understand what is actually coordination compounds so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood this video very clearly and i hope i'll see you next time and then don't forget to subscribe to channel thank you so much